Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. It, it is the 29th of January 2017, sometimes AM, where I'm at. Uh, Mr. Trump. Mr. Trump. See, it was a showdown between the Bushes, okay, the Clintons, and the Sahuniya Al-Alamiya, and the Mafia from everywhere. The drug cartels. How's that? Of course, on the top of the food chain is the Sahyuniya Al-Alamiya. They know that their end is about, inshallah, <laughs> is soon. And they know that their end on the hands of Ummati Muhammad. They know that very well. See, when, to, when they went to the Middle East, which is 200 years ago, the British, or a little bit more than that, actually, 1700, they knew exactly what the, uh, they were doing. They knew what they taken themselves into. We all met you, Muhammad. Make no mistake. And all these clowns that they talking like, oh wow, what are you gonna kick their ass, and uh, uh, the terrorist is gonna come and get us, and we are uh, to protect ourselves uh, from uh, uh, the San Bernardino and uh, Muhammad Chaban and all these terrorist homegrowns. Uh, <laughs> And uh, sleeping cells, even though we don't sleep, because we are all drugged and punks, punks, right? I again, Mr. Trump, the United States of America as we know it. I mean, the Zionist controlled United States of America it's history it's a history we all met you Muhammad Kongs we all met you Muhammad and we're claiming our deen Kongs we're saving humanity Kongs we all met you Muhammad we don't get intimidated. We don't back off when it comes to La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. And we enjoy our jihad. We enjoy it. You know why? Because it's all from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Decree upon you, Hasbu Shaitan, to do what you do and decree his mercy. And everything. So please again, Mr. Uh, Captain America, <laughs> you're gonna make it great. Okay, well, let's start with you. Get rid of you, you criminal, you fraud. All right. Do you know who's gonna whack your ass? It's the cartel, the mafia, because you're messing with them. Punk. <laughs> anyway, anyway, <clears throat> as in uh, in the big picture, in the small picture, this uh, little uh, 
law enforcement here in, uh, in uh, independent state of Santa Barbara committing crimes and thinking that they are allowed to. <laughs> now because Mr. Trump is in office, he's going to make it great again. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I'm just uh, enjoying the ride, you punks. Enjoying the ride. Now, for the United States of America, now, because of uh, Mohammed Shaban and his saga, uh, sharpen up your pencil, punks. Sharpen up your pencil. My name is Mohammed. Muhammad Shawi Shaban. My wife. Belinda. She wear a hijab <laughs> and claim to be a Muslim to get the green card and to go and visit her family in Mexico. And then when she comes back, she take it off. <laughs> and I think she's a Jew from Mexico City Jews. Jennifer Mitz as well. Yeah, she cleared. Jennifer actually, she did a lot of reading and studying. And she was convinced. I didn't force no one. And then all hell got loose. Now, it is not an accident that they all got divorced. They all got left to uh, Louisiana. <laughs> Starting with uh, an evil first. And everything was staged. If they're dead or not, everything was staged. And they victimized my children. They victimized everyone, including themselves. Because La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. I know you hate us. <laughs> because we're free. La hawla hawla qata illa billah. Because we're Ummati Muhammad, punks. We're Ummati Muhammad. And we heard and learned that you have sweet blood, punks. You call me anything you want, fellas. Answers. The FBI and the Department of Injustice and the State Department. All of you punks, answers to Mohammed Shaban and millions of others. To Mohammed Shaban and billions of others all over the globe. Especially Ummati Muhammad. Answers. Got it? Call me anything you want, fellas. You all have a nice day now. <laughs>